to be honest, I only see this video once. I can't even see it like more than one time. This video of her 16-year-old daughter getting hit in the Baldwin Park High School girls' bathroom supposedly on October 18th. You can see other students watching the fight along with this man identified as one of the school's security guards by Maria Fajardo and her attorney. And this security guard allowed all the students to come in as if they were spectators at a UFC fight. And guess what? This security guard has a smirk or a smile on his face while this fight is taking place. Fajardo says that after the fight, her daughter called her on the phone and that it was she, not the school, that called police. I just want you to send someone because my daughter, she has, she's injured in the restroom. You guys need to send someone right away. There are boys and girls that are fighting and they just don't notify the parents, don't tell them. That's the word from other parents at the school who don't want their faces on camera, saying there's a problem. And then when you ask about it, they say that they're, uh, they can't talk about it. Parents and students say the security guard has been here for many years, but has been seen at other schools since the fight. It's possible that Baldwin Park Unified School District might have sent this security guard to another school. If that is the case, then this is the most shocking case of gross negligence I have ever seen. Baldwin Park Unified sending us a statement saying, quote, the safety of our students is the district's highest priority. No comment beyond that. They won't even tell us if that security guard is or isn't working at another school. In Baldwin Park, I'm Christina Gonzalez, Fox 11 News.